And I do need to say before I get into this video that you shouldn't treat this as financial advice. All I'm simply gonna be doing is sharing what I've done on my own journey when it comes to using ChatGPT to help me make money. There's no guarantee that you're gonna be able to make a certain amount of money. You know, there's always a risk when it comes to building up a business, but as long as you're aware of what goes into it, you're gonna be able to educate yourself on exactly what you need to do or what you shouldn't do. So just treat this video as a form of entertainment or education, but I'm sure that if you're able to stick through this video from start to finish, you're definitely going to learn something that's gonna give you the knowledge that you need when it comes to potential making money online. But let's not waste any more time. Let me jump straight into one of the first lazy steps, which is that you're going to use ChatGPT to help you find a successful online seller that you're gonna be able to replicate. So guys, if you're new to this channel and you don't know my backstory, I've been able to build up various different online businesses that have allowed me to quit my nine to five job. And the way that I was able to be successful with these different businesses was replicating what was already working. Just to give you some insight on what I'm talking about, I was working a nine to five job and it was during that job where I was trying various different side hustles. And with all of these different side hustles that weren't working, it was because I was trying to reinvent the wheel and I was trying to do something that no one had ever done before. But one day I had a random idea, which was why don't I just copy a successful store that's active right now, where I can see the products that they're selling and the money that they're making. And as soon as I did that, that's when things completely blew up. So we can actually use ChatGPT to help us with this part of the process. So to do this, you're just gonna open it up just like this and you're gonna type in a simple prompt. So the one that I'm going to type in is gonna be this. I'm gonna say, can you provide me with 10 active, successful Shopify dropshipping stores that can easily be replicated? Ensure that they're selling products that can easily be found on AliExpress and also make sure that they're not big brands. So I'm just going to type this in. You can tailor it in any way that you want, but for now I'm gonna leave it as it is and I'm gonna click on enter. Okay, perfect. So it's instantly come back with all of these different stores that we're gonna be able to go away and do a little bit more research into. Of course, on the surface, we can't just look at this information and say, I'm gonna copy this store or this one and I'm gonna become rich because it doesn't work like that. You're gonna to have to dig a little bit deeper. So let me look at this store right here called Pet Clever. If I just open up their site, as we can see, it looks like a super simple store that anyone can build. They've got all of these different products that are obviously targeted towards pet owners and it just seems like a general niche store where these are the type of items that they're focused on. Now when you get to this point over here you're not just going to be able to look at a store and say that they're successful what you need to do is copy the URL of the store just like this and then you're going to open up a website called Zeke Analytics. Now I've been speaking about Zeke Analytics on this channel for many years reason being is that I've been using it for many years and it's helped me generate thousands of dollars. You you can use it for a number of different things, you know, spying on eBay stores, but you can also use it when it comes to spying on active Shopify stores as well. All you gotta do is create your account, which you can do with a seven day trial. Log into your account and just paste the URL of the store that you're looking to research in here just like this and then click on search. And instantly it should come back with a screen that looks like this. It's gonna let you know how many products they've got in their store right now, you know, how many sales they've been able to bring in in the last 30 days and how much money they was able to bring in in the last month as well. So just like that, ChatGPT has allowed us to find a store that is, you know, making decent money. I'm not saying that you're gonna be able to bring this amount of money in straight away, but even if you make a percentage of it, you know that the concept of this particular store works. And you're also gonna be able to scroll down here just like this and see all of the different items that they've got listed in their store right now. And that's the thing about using a software like Zeke Analytics. You don't have to rely on the data that ChatGPT gives you. You can skip that step if you want to, come over to Zeke Analytics, and then on the left-hand side over here, you're going to see this one that says Store Finder. It's gonna be over here where you're gonna be able to type in the keyword of the store that you're looking to build. So I'm just gonna type in pet just like that. I'm gonna select store type as dropshipping. I want the currency of the store to be mainly in USD and I want the store to be bringing in minimum $10,000 every month. So once you've entered your filters just like this, you could just click on search. And then from here, Zeke Analytics is gonna be able to show you all of these different stores. So what you can do from this point is just sort the revenue from highest to lowest, and then simply scroll down and you're gonna have all of these different options when it comes to all of these different stores. Now, the good thing about this is that you can click into any one of these 
these ones i'm going to click into this one and as you can see there's going to be a lot more options when it comes to stores that are bringing in bigger numbers and if you didn't already know when it comes to using zeke analytics you can scroll down just like this and click into the right hand side and it's going to be able to show you the products that's in their store and where you can find it in terms of aliexpress and alibaba but once you've found a store that you want to replicate you know what type of products you want to sell the second step that ChatGPT is going to be able to assist you with is going to be with creating a solid business plan. And one of the things that I've noticed that so many beginners end up getting stuck on is knowing what they need to do in a step-by-step -step format. So knowing what products are selling well is one thing, but knowing what step to take is the next thing. So what I've done is created this quiz that you can see on the screen. It doesn't cost anything to use, but it's going to be able to help you when it comes to giving you a personalized, customized business plan based on your own situation. So all you got to do is answer around five questions. So I'm just going to do that right now. Let's do it together. What type of product do you prefer to sell? Of course, in this case, we're looking at physical products. So I'm going to select it just like this and click on next. How much money do you have to invest up front? I'm going to say between 100 to $500. Where do you want to sell your products? I'm going to say my own store, Shopify, because it just gives a little bit more flexibility. What niche are you focused on? Of course, in this case, we're focused on pet products. How much time can you dedicate towards this every week? I'm going to say that I can dedicate 10 plus hours. And finally, how would you like to market your store? I'm going to say I would prefer free marketing methods, you know, things like SEO, social media, blogging, influencer marketing, so on and so forth. And then I'm going to click on next. And then from there, it should give you this prompt that you're going to paste into ChatGPT. So this prompt, again, is customized to the answers that you gave it. So you're just going to copy everything just like this. You're going to come back onto ChatGPT, paste all of it in here just like this, and then click on enter. And instantly, it should come back with this business plan, as I've already mentioned, breaking down everything that you're going to need to do, you know, recommendations. And it's also going to give you a step-by-step -step checklist. So I definitely recommend everyone that wants to start this side hustle to check this out because the quiz is just going to make everything so much more easier. And just to quickly break down the information that you're going to get in this business plan, it's going to give you the step-by-step -step setup process as well as the email marketing sequence that you can use when it comes to, you know, doing your email marketing campaigns. You're going to be able to get, you know, business and domain name ideas article titles when it comes to publishing blog articles on your Shopify store, the marketing strategy and you know all of the supplier information, just everything you need when it comes to hitting the ground running. But once you've gotten to the point where you've made your solid business plan and you know what steps you need to take, the next lazy step when it comes to using ChatGPT is going to be with assistance to complete your online store. So as you guys may or may not know, when it comes to building a Shopify store really quick, this is the tool that you need to use. Now, I've spoken about it on my channel recently, but they've made some changes when it comes to the quality of the store that it's able to build. I'm just going to show you the initial part of the process and I'm going to go over and show you the store that it was able to build for me. So I'm just going to click on build my free store. I'm going to select that I wanted to build me a pet store, of course. I then need to select a couple different images that I want to be on the store. I'm also going to have to activate my Shopify trial as well. Bear in mind that when it comes to building your site using AI, you're not going to have to pay anything for the design, for the theme or anything like that. You are going to have to pay $1 when it comes to using Shopify, but there's not going to be any limitations with that. You're not going to be capped as to the amount of money that you can make. So it's really a no brainer when it comes to using this. But as we can see over here, the store has been built. If I just click on view your store, as we can see, the quality is amazing. Everything looks professional. You know, everything is well done. And it even comes preloaded with all of these different products that you can start selling straight away. But you're probably wondering right now, but Sam, how exactly has ChatGPT helped with this part of the process? Well, don't forget with the business plan, it's going to be able to help when it comes to a lot of the back end stuff that you need to do, you know, getting your domain as well as setting up, you know, your email marketing system 
systems, just everything that's gonna go on the back end. And even when it comes to any adjustments that you might wanna make, ChatGPT is gonna be able to help you with that. For example, as you can see on this site that I've been able to build with AI, there isn't a about us page. And I'm not saying that it's 100% necessary, but if you wanted to add a page that talks about the company that you're building, you can simply go back onto ChatGPT and ask it to give you, you know, 500 words, maybe 600 words when it comes to the about us page that you can now copy and paste into the back end of your Shopify store. Literally, if I just come over here to pages, I click on about us, it's going to be over here where I'm going to be able to paste all of the information. The main point is with any text that goes onto your website, into your emails, you know, just anything when it comes to any written information, that's where ChatGPT is going to be able to assist you. But this now brings me on to one of the fourth lazy steps that you need to know when it comes to getting a successful side hustle off the ground, which is going to, of course, be in relation to generating traffic onto your site. Now, one important thing that you need to understand when it comes to making money with sites just like this is that you're not going to be able to make a single dollar, a single cent if you don't have people coming onto your website on a daily basis, you know, viewing different aspects of it, whether it's the products that you're selling or even some sort of informative articles. I found from the different stores that I've ran over the years, you know, the ones that I've generated over six figures from is that if you're able to publish articles on your site on a daily consistent basis, you're going to be able to get organic traffic going onto your site and not all of these people are going to turn into paying customers but there's going to be a percentage of them that will and this is something that so many different store owners are doing right now as we speak you can go onto google yourself type in a random search term there's going to be so many different results that are going to pop up but there's going to be sites just like this you know simple drop shipping stores where they've been able to get ranked on the first page of google and if you also check their revenue on zeke analytics you're going to see that they are bringing in decent sales and this is something that you're going to be able to automate, you know, with the help of this website over here. So they haven't sponsored me. I wish they did. But the reason why I'm talking about them is because I know that it could be beneficial to you. So all you got to do is create your account for completely free. And the way that it works is that you can set up an automation when it comes to blog articles being published on your website automatically without you having to do anything. And it's all going to come from you setting up something called a sequence. So I've got this sequence already set up right here where I insert blog article titles into a Google Sheet. And this Google Sheet is connected directly to ChatGPT. So from there, what it's going to do is create an article from scratch and automatically publish it onto a Shopify store. So think about it. Everything is going to be automated. Articles are going to be written and published every single day. And, you know, you're going to be able to get organic traffic without having to do too much and it goes about saying that there is going to be some work that you're going to have to do to make sure that you've set this up in the right way so if you wanted to watch a recent youtube video that i made not too long ago where i go through all of the steps that you need to be aware of as a complete beginner you're going to be able to watch that video by clicking the link over there watch that straight after this because it's already helped out so many people and i'm sure if you're able to watch that video from start to finish it can also help you out as well but other than that guys i'll catch you on that next video make sure you stay safe out there Peace.